Hello, welcome. This is Nate. How are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are having a really blessed day today. So today we're going to take a look at this uh, Pinehurst Model 2502 at United Family Homes here in Nampa, Idaho. This home is made by Kit Homes. This is just under 1,300 square foot. So not a super large home by any means, but uh, overall, very well laid out home. Like I said, this is a overall a very nice home. Very well laid out. So just a couple of quick things that I would change if I could. So there's going to be your back door and you had a side door. All your doors are going to have those uh, nice blinds in the windows. All these kit homes now come standard with the new updated Neum insulation package. For those of you in the northwest, that is a, a plus. So these are pretty close together here, so we'll just kind of get a quick view back there. So as I was saying, those of you here in the Northwest, that upgraded insulation package is uh, now standard. Will definitely help keep your uh, electric bill down in the winter time. Now I don't know about here in, in uh, Nampa, Idaho, how cold it gets in the winter time, but I know up where I live in Montana, we have quite a few days in the winter that are below zero. So that'll definitely help. So now as you can see when you walk in, the home's kind of divided into two sections, so to say. You got all your kids rooms and everything down there, dining room, kitchen, master bedroom, everything out at that end. <clears throat> Not a big hallway. But one thing I do like about all the Pioneer series that I've filmed so far here in the Northwest, all the kit homes has these vaulted ceilings and big windows in your living room. Now with the way the sun's out right now, the angle of the sun, it's making it a little harder to get you a good shot of this living room. You might even have to flip the light on just if I can even find the right switch. There we go. That'll work. That helps. So anyway, decent sized living room. Like I said, this home isn't the largest. It's only 1,280 square feet, so just under 1,300 square feet. Still get a nice size kitchen. Nice island. Seating for four at least. Now this has the black Frigidaire appliances. Has your uh, darker stained cabinets. Now one thing I don't see in this home that I have seen in some of the larger kit homes, there's no uh, built-in garbage rack or garbage drawer, no spice rack, nothing like that built into this one. But you do got nice sized drawers above everything. Soft clothes on the drawers. Hi, so this is me and I want to tell you that I have to interrupt my dad's shows for important messages. That's right, folks. Come on down to the fine folks at uh, United Family Homes, and they will hook you up with a $500 discount the next time you come down here and talk to them and sign a home. Once again, tell them Nate sent you. He'll give you a $500 discount off the purchase price of your home. Back to my dad's regular person shop.
I thought I turned the light on in here, but I guess not. Hence the reason why I'm having some issues with some of the some of the shots. There we go. That's better. So you got a nice size counter though. Double sink. Still got a good size window above your sink there. I said overall this home is designed really well. Not a lot I would want to change on it. Good sized dining table still. Plenty of room for four people. Might even be able to fit a slightly larger table in there. There's that back door with those blinds. And back here is your utility room. Now these homes are, they've got the AC turned on, which is really nice because it is over 100 degrees outside. So just imagine what it would be like in here. So I know you can hear it. So let's close this here pocket door. Now you can still hear the air coming out of the vents, but you can see just how much quieter that actually got by closing that door. So I'll uh, try to be real brief in here with the uh, AC running. That is your back door. It's about the only door that doesn't have your blinds in it. Your washer and dryer. A couple of cabinets over here. A oh, bunch of trim supplies. Water here. Now that door goes into your master bathroom. We'll come back to that here in just a moment. And that is the master bathroom that I would uh, probably want to make a couple of changes to if I could figure out what to how to do something different there. So this is your master, or not master, <laughs> it might as well be the master bathroom because like I said I would want to make a couple changes to it because this is your guest bathroom. Hello Raiden. So the guest bathroom is almost just as big if not bigger than your master bathroom. I know that sounds, shouldn't even, almost don't even want to call it a master bathroom but like I said, that's why I would want to make some changes. This is your one piece shower tub combo. It does have your standard kit home really deep tub. Now I haven't seen Chance's version of the, of the video. He beat me here by a week. He's already got one of them up on his channel as of today, which being today is Thursday. So we had it up on Tuesday. This is the middle of August. so. I'm curious to see what his tour is, what he thinks of the bathroom when he gets to it. <laughs> so this is bedroom number one. And he said he beat me here by a week, although I have had this planned for a couple of weeks to come out here and film. Unfortunately, due to regular, my full-time job, I was not able to make it out due to uh, an employee getting I don't even know if I can say it on YouTube without getting banned or sanctioned or whatever but that bug that's got everybody in an uproar so that left us extremely short-handed so I had to postpone my trip here So bedrooms are decent size for being a 1200 or 1300 square foot home. So I'll have dimensions up once I get a copy of the floor plans and get a chance to edit the video. So coming down here is going to be your master bedroom. 
Once again, there's your kitchen area here. So this is going to be your master bedroom. Not too bad size for the master bedroom. You know, this bedroom isn't isn't large by any means, but uh, still plenty of room here. Nice size windows in here. This is probably going to be where you're going to put your bed is up against this wall here, just kind of give you a, a lengthwise or a view of it. And your closet's over here. Nope, I guess there's no light in this closet. So not the biggest of closets either, but still fairly long closet. I'll close the doors here, get you a shot of just the kind of overall length of your closet here. So your closet's gonna run from basically that wall. Let's see if I can get the camera to, there we go, from that wall all the way over to there, so. Not quite that far, obviously, as pointing outside, but yeah, you get the idea. <laughs> so here is the master bathroom. Now, as you can see, when we come in, it is fairly small. You do have your counter space here. Nice mirror, though. I do like the upgraded mirror that they put in here with the uh, lights in the mirror. So overall, like I said, your bathroom is kind of on the small side. As I said, your guest bathroom is just as big, if not bigger. But now here is your shower, which is a, overall, it's a decent sized shower. So there's definitely not room for a tub in here. Now I would probably, if I could, upgrade that to a tile shower. I think that would make the bathroom much better just by upgrading that to a tile shower. Now me being a single guy, I don't need a tub anyway. If I did need one, well there's one in the guest bathroom. So back over here in your laundry room, as you can see we come all the way through there. Now if it was my home being right off the back door, I'm not so sure I want a door going in there. So maybe option that out if you can. So I know this one's a little bit shorter than what some of mine are. This is a smaller house. So if you've liked what you've seen, don't forget to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you get notified when I upload videos. Currently uploading twice a week on Sundays and Wednesdays. Soon to be on Fridays. So this may be a Friday video, who knows when it comes, by the time I get the chance to start uploading. But I will see you in the next one. Thanks a lot. Bye.